So, as sort of a comedic actress in Hollywood, I imagine you get a million funny scripts sent your way, as opposed to dramatic ones. Is that yeah? yeah? I definitely get. I get yes. Um, but you know, it's tricky because there just aren't that many scripts out there for for women in mm-hmm. comedy. If there are, they're sort of the bounce card character. They're the character that's like you know the straight woman to the funny guy. Right. So um, yeah, I think that it's sort of forced me to be a little proactive in, in trying to find those scripts and develop them and uh-huh. things like that. And does it have to be like laugh out loud funny? I mean, when you're reading the script, you have to be laugh. How do you tell if it's going to really? I think that it's the character. If the character has a lot of potential, then um, then there's something interesting to explore there and develop. But very few scripts are laugh out loud. <laughs> I can imagine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They don't come my way. What do you make of this whole? I know everyone's talking about this. We talked about the bridesmaids effect, but you know, do you, are you do you like being singled out as one of sort of the funny women in Hollywood leading that charge? It feels it's terrifying. There's a lot of pressure to that because I never really thought of myself as a funny person. Uh, really? Why? Yeah. I don't know, just because I was always um, I always did tra- drama growing up. I was yeah. really like a serious kid, and I did I sort of fell into comedy. And I don't know. It wasn't intentional, so it's never really felt like. You know, completely at home. But I love it. It's a big more. Would you go back to your dramatic roots? Do you think that that would happen? I'd love to do a dramatic role at some point. I hope that I do comedy. It's great to meet you.